and Katie, we're running to Walmart to stock up on toilet paper and stuff for our house, for our, our renters. And um, then we are gone from today until the beginning of December. And then we don't know what we're doing, but we're definitely not going to be back in Colorado. I think we're coming back here to, to snowboard this winter, but who knows? I know we're going to hang out in Rock Island, Tennessee for a couple months or weeks or whatever, however long the weather is good. And then to Texas for Thanksgiving, like all the And then after that, we just don't know. I want to go to Chile. Do you want to go to Chile? Yeah. So want to go to Chile. I'm reading, I have a friend on Facebook who lives in Chile, and I keep reading all of her statuses, and just the way Chilean moms are, I'm like, that's me. I'm a Chilean mom. I want to be a Chilean mom. And so yeah, that, that's the plan. Don't you hate it when bloggers do that, and they're like, blah, blah, blah. And so, yeah. And so, yeah, I hate it when I say it. I hate it when other bloggers say it. Sissy, don't say. And so, yeah. Oh, it's behind the trash can. It's behind the trash can. Oh, and there's Take big the dog clothes, cars, big trash can. Cars. Take it out. Mommy. No, it's not behind. <laughs> Mommy. Allie, where's your no, ball? Where ball Mommy, I can't Allie, go surf. Where is the ball? You know where the ball is? <laughs> there it is. <laughs> She's like, my oh, crazy. Okay, it's so crazy. Okay, so Terry's new haircut. Adorableness. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm waiting for Dan because we're going to dinner with some friends here, and uh, he had to go back up because we got an emergency call that our swamp cooler like blew up. There was water everywhere. So Dan ran home, and I'm sitting here, I'm starving. So the pool, let me explain to you. This pool, I'm mad at it today. They ran into the nastiest people possible Allie. today. Um, Kenny, Dally, Cardi, and Rowdy got yelled at by some random man about splashing in the pool and how they better settle down because there's a lot of old people in the pool and they're damaged and they don't want to be wet. Let me explain, can I say that again? They're at the pool in the water and they don't want to get wet. I'm just gonna let that sink in. What's wrong with that sentence? The fact that they're in the pool in the water and they don't want to get wet. So they got screamed at by some man. And then um, he was like so mad at them. Yeah, he was so mad at them. And so they moved and they were yelled at for throwing this like foam football thing. And so no footballs are allowed in the pool, so they were like, okay, and they threw that out. And then I went into the big pool, and I was just throwing Ellie up in the air. She's heavy, you know, I can't throw her that far. She might have gone three feet up with her head, you know, and the lifeguard was screaming and screaming, and I heard him, but I wasn't acknowledging him. And this one guy walked up to me, and he's like, hey, the lifeguard's yelling at you to stop throwing the baby up in the air. Okay. We also got yelled everything. at for playing our funnest game, chicken. Yeah, and they got yelled at for um, playing chicken in the pool. This then they got yelled at for wrestling underwater at the pool. And then the clincher of the whole entire day was when they were throwing the little Jackson sponge, the smiley face sponge, because they had nothing else to play with because there's no toys allowed. So they brought a sponge in and the lifeguards let that go. And um, they threw it and it landed like from where I am to about where the sink is, right? That distance away from this woman. And Brody thinks maybe it splashed her. He wasn't sure. And he's just giving her the benefit of the doubt that maybe she got like a couple droplets of water on her and she was floating in the water with her head on some kind of green floating. And Brody was like, oh, I'm so sorry. And he went to pick it up and she was staring at him. And he's like, and she goes, not half as sorry as you'll be if it hits me. No, she said, you don't know how sorry oh. you're going to be if that hits me. So she said, you don't know how sorry you're going to be if that hits me. And then what happened? And then she said, I don't know why all you little grubs can't go play in the backyard. And then 
I don't know why all you little grubs can't go play in the backyard. Why can't she go play in the backyard at your house? The, I don't know. What is a grub? Hold on. Google that. Somebody tell me. What is a grub? It's a bug? Little bugs that you find in logs. She called you a grub? It's larva of an insect. I didn't know what a grub was. <laughs> that changes everything for me now. All right, and then what? And then, and, and, I, and then I was like, well, it's fun in the pool. And she said, well, I, well all the other kids can see you playing in their backyard. And then I said, well, there's a whole lot well, all those other kids are right here. And yeah, then I said, all the kids are right here. And then I said, well, you know, there's a hot tub over there that you can't get splashed in. And she says, well, well you, you know, there's millions of backyards. And then I just said, excuse me. I would have pointed out every other kid in the pool. Would have been like, he's not in his backyard. He's I feel like not in going to find her now. Because I actually kept my mouth shut. I, and I was like, gosh, I should really walk up to her and let her know that, you know, my kids deserve to be spoken to with respect. And I was like, you know, I wanted to say that so bad, but I just didn't. You should have told her to go tan in the backyard. Yeah. Yeah. But people were so ugly today. I don't know what the nastiness was. And um, this pool is just getting really regulated. And so it got me to thinking, I know, so slow down there, Susie. It got me to thinking that where can kids be kids anymore? Literally, they have to go out into the woods, which we do. You, you cannot be a kid if there's another adult anywhere in the vicinity of you because they don't want to see you. They don't want to hear you. They don't want to be splashed by you. They don't want to hear you squealing. They don't want to have to watch you. Just. They're flat out miserable. Adults are miserable and they're making childhood miserable for kids. Is he cute or what? So that's my soapbox. That's it. Um, what are you playing, Ellie? See, I'm like you now. I have all these things I want to say to this lady. The yeah. alphabet? What letter is that? She's so lucky I wasn't there. B? It's a B for Brody and Baby and Baba. I know. I know. She's so lucky I wasn't there. I would have said She's something. so lucky something stopped me. I don't know what it was. I just, I guess I didn't want to get into it. Look at Maddie's eye now. So much better. What do you want? Kobe! Hi. Uh oh. Um, but we do this, then we come back and we co we come up with all these funny one-liners that the kids come up with because you know they can't say it because they don't want them to be rude little brats. So they pretty much mind their tongue, and then they come over here and they're like, "Oh, do we have a story to tell you?" And usually, I march my butt over there and I have a few choice words, but I I didn't know what to say this time. I was just like. A little floored, and I thought that it might degrade into a very unflattering conversation, if you will. Okay, I think somebody's hungry. Candid Kim!